Good morning, guys. Welcome back. You know what time it is. It's midweek madness. Back at the midweek car boot. I think I actually prefer these to the weekend ones. There's normally less competition. I can have a bit of a browse a lot easier. So, yeah, let's see what we can find today. I did stumble across these earlier. I've got an old low books. But it says they're all 20p each. Okay, how much for the whole bag? I think it looks to be sort of maybe 15. So oh, three quid. Three quid for the whole lot, yeah? Yeah, and you can have the bag with it. Oh, you're very kind. <laughs> uh, let's see. Here we go, you got to change for a fiver. Yeah, I can do that. Thank you very much. Too, Am I right to leave them with you? Because they'll weigh a bit, lugging them round. Am I right to leave them just behind your van, if that's all right? Yeah, I'll bring you over. Yeah, yeah. Over Lovely job, thank you. Oh, I don't know what these will be worth, but it can't be bad. Three quid for a lot. That's oh, great, mate. No, Lovely job. Yeah. Cheers. I'll swing back around for them in a little bit. I'll swing back around for them in a little bit. Depends if that is bell stuff. Oh, we got here. Tags look alright. Stitching's okay. It's not all over the place like most of them. Which label looks good. How much are your clothes, mate? Are they all... Uh, all priced individual. Okay. 15. 15, yeah. Okie dokie. Let's look at that. Oh, Bergy. I think it's the same one I'm wearing, actually. Let's see, that was a women's one. Mm -mm -mm. CDG. Who knows? Penfield. Just doesn't really sell for anything. But a nice t-shirt. LL Bean. Very good. But again. Nice plaid that one. A bit older. Made in the USA. We've got a crossfell. Very nice. Another LL Bean jacket. Stronghold. Don't know anything about that. Might have a quick look online. Got some Paul Smiths. Don't normally pick those up really. What else we got? We've got some Wranglers again. Not a lot of money in those. A Berghaus Aqua Foil. Another one, I think. Or is this just like a light Gore Tex? I don't even think it's Gore Tex. Blue Alpine. Should take a risk on that. The mountain equipment is there as well. Hmm. Could wipe me out here. Yeah? How much would these be, mate? Which one? Sorry, this one for five, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Uh, so... I want these. Sorry? I wanted a tenner each for these. You wanted a tenner each? Um, but I put the... Uh, Thirty quid for the lot. Thirty quid for the lot. How much for the low alpine as well? You wanted a 20 for that? Yeah, it's just been pretty good neck and I've just watched it. So yeah, fair enough. I might leave this one here, all if right. that's alright. How much should that bring it down to? Including that one. Um, I might swap it out for... Let's have a look. She said you got 20 on the lowy. Yeah. Uh, I probably spent the time watching that <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah, it is a nice one. Uh, how much is your light burghouse here? Not the Gore-Tex one. Tenner for that one. Okie dokie. Uh, how much for this one thrown in as well? With that and those, I do... I do think Yeah, yeah. Alright, that, that sounds good to me. No, no, of course. I understand that. Lovely job, thanks nice. so much, mate. No How much are your shoes here, if you don't mind me asking? Uh, I wanted 15 for them just because the soles are so good. Okay, yeah, fair uh, enough. And the Air Max? 
Fiver. Fiver, yeah, that's fair enough. And then probably 10 for these ones. Yeah, that's all right. Okay, okay, if I've got anything left over, I'll swing by. Ooh, not a bad start this morning. Parted with a fair bit of cash there, but I think it's definitely worth it. We'll make it up in no time with just one of those sales. Now we've got some hats. What have we got here? Blank. Primark. Who's this? Hard Rock Glass for Barcelona. Can't forget about my books at the end. Man, I nearly forgot about those just now. What's down here? Oh, we've got no cardinals. A kid size large, looks like it. Old A6 track jacket. Ooh, hello. Morning, you're right. Okay, all right. Do you want to pass them to me so I can put it up? Yeah, yeah, go for it. And that one. And that blue one. Uh, oh yes, sorry. <laughs> oh wait, uh, yes, yeah, yeah. So I picked up another blue one this morning. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Rhyming. <laughs> yeah, a bit niche. Yeah, I was going to say, I've never seen anything quite like that before. 13, you say, yeah? Yep. Okie dokie. Would you go 12? Yeah, go Yeah, on. lovely job, thank you. There we go, 10 and 12. Cheers. Thanks so much. Oh, the dog's got the tippy taps. Hello. Remember me? Let's see what they got today. Real life crimes. Got two cardigan right off the bat. Needs a wash. That's quite a nice one actually, with that kind of low key pattern. Take that, probably like 50p. Morning, it's just the uh, cardigan in the top there. Pound. 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 There you go, thank you. Pound inflation, normally 50p I think. Morning mate, you alright? Yeah. yeah, not too bad, thank you. Thought I'll have a gander what you got. How much is uh, this one here? No, no. That's here was 50 in. It cost a fortune. How much? It cost a fortune, 50 in. 50? 15. Oh, 15. Oh, okay. That's All right. Cheap. That's fair enough. Hard to get. Very hard. Fair enough. All right. <laughs> Shame that's not bigger on the high rig. There's more also. Is there, yeah? All right, I'll have a look. All right, thank you. There's my team. Sorry? Well, you've got that one yesterday. Oh, uh, really? I've got one a few weeks ago. There's another little one on there. Ah, uh, okay. The, the big one is cool, eight. Yeah, yeah, super fast. Yeah. Me, hey, man. David Villa. What player he was back in the day. 
Is that a large? There's no date on it there. Which worries me a little bit. <laughs> if it's a fake, it's a good fake. Here we go. 2001 England. Man, the refros are so good these days. I can't even tell the refros from the originals a lot of the time. Made in China. Looks okay. Tags old. I think that's alright. Two thousand five, I think, on oh, that one. This one's a little bit later. <laughs> Matching. How much for these three and the, the one in there? That's good you are, did you? Yeah. 35 bad, you 30. 30, yeah. yeah. Do you mind if I just see it again if that's alright? Thank you. That's fine. Love you, thank you. So I'll wash out fine, that'll be fine. Just vanish, won't it? It should be. It's just when it fell off the wheels. Yeah, yeah. And uh, so, do you mind if I just see the other one again, if that's alright? Thank you. That's good. 25 on its own, I've sold one of them. Oh, really? Yeah. Wow. Or just online? No, I just sold one of my mates. Oh, really? Yeah. 30, yeah? So we've got running thin. You got a bag here? Uh, yeah, I've got a bag, mate. Yeah. 20, 22. 23, 23, 70. That's not going to cut it. Uh, would you take PayPal bank transfer? I can't do that. You can't? No worries. I've only got 23, 70 on me. Um, so whatever I can get for that. Yeah, that would be. Easy. Yeah. There we go. Do you tell anybody else? No, of course not. Thank you, mate. I appreciate that. Ah, cheers, mate. Alrighty, it's been a very good morning as it turns out. So I think I paid, I, I spent all my cash actually. It came to, I think, 63.70 to be exact. Uh, this is what we got. I wouldn't normally pick this up, but as it was cheap and festival season is fast approaching the next couple of months, it's just an ASICS track jacket that should sell pretty fast, especially the ones with these sort of tape sleeves. Um, all the kids love these. So this will be an easy sort of 15 to 20, just a little embroidered logo on the front there, old 90s number. Um, and then we've got this Mambo Gilet. She said, is a pound all right for this? I was like, yeah. Um, so we took that little embroidered Mambo hit on the front there. Design in Australia, probably made in China, but still you're looking at sort of 30, 35, I think for one of these, for the sort of fleece lining, very nice. Then we've got this nice pale blue Yves Saint Laurent tee, size large, probably fits more like a medium to be honest looking at it. Logo's a little faded, but the wear on it is really nice actually. I'm um, looking at sort of 35, 40 on this one. And then this one here, Bike Topperfest, Bike Topperfest, however you say it, 2010. But these Harley style tees always go for quite a lot in recent years. You're going to get sort of 15 to 20 on that. Um, and then we've got this, which is kind of cool, Atlantis Space Shuttle World Tour. Um, that's one that everyone thinks of, isn't it? Um, just on the old Delta Pro weight there, size large, XL. This one here, you're probably looking at nothing much, maybe 15 pound, but all the tour dates on the back there, which is pretty cool. Um, 2002, some sort of golf champion thing, US Open, not a clue. Um, on an old Toltex, but sort of, I don't know if it's a repro, so it's 2002. Tag looks kind of new, but it's an older one, so still, that's going to be sort of £15. Pounds. Um, Disney Aladdin T, nothing crazy, it's from the, I think the musical in London actually, but it's a nice graphic on it. Um, good tag as well, so that'd probably be, I don't know, like £10, pound, maybe 12 tops. And then we just got your basic champion tee for summer um and that'll be again sort of like 10 12 15 a little bit just on the arm there nothing too crazy so i think that lot there came to 12 pound which is really good onto these which are really cool i'm excited about these um so this one here is a kids one but you could wear these as a couple as like a matching co-ward set 
which is really cool. Um, so we've got these Mickey baseball jerseys, full embroidered logo, just a little Mickey with the baseball bat signet, very cool on both sleeves. Um, and then a full embroidery, that's just so clean. Uh, just the little details as well, it's great, even on the buttons. Um, so these are old, they are very late 90s, maybe early 2000s. This one here is a kid size small, and this one here is an adult's medium, but they fit oversized. So this one here probably fit a women's six through to 10, to be honest. Um, and this one here, I forgot to say, on the back as well, big embroidery again, Mickey 28 spell out. Um, same on this one. So on that, you're probably looking at sort of 30, 35, this one here. Same again, because I doubt too many guys are going to be wanting something like this. Maybe a girl will wear it super oversized. But again, this one here should be sort of 30, 35, maybe 40. Pushing as it's the largest size. Again, the full embroidery, which is super cool. Then we've got this 2001 Inglos, In Jesus, England top. Um, 2001 to 2003, just there. I never know on these days. I think this is legit, because all the stuff I've picked up from that guy before, he's got a few fakes in there. Um, but for the most part, it's all good stuff. So just a little mark on the front, that'll wash out super easy with some vanish. But when the next major tournament rolls around again, uh, which will be the Euros next, wouldn't it? Is it World Cup? No, it's Euros, of course it is. Um, that'll be a sort of easy 35 to 40 pounds. So I'm happy to sit on that for a couple of years, or well, next year now. Um, then we've got this one. This was just a 2005, 2007, last of the good England kits, I think for me. Um, again, this one is legit. Um, sort of similar money, five or less, maybe sort of 30, 35. It's got Bobby Robson, number six on the back of that one, which is a nice tribute, I think. Um, and then we've got this. Um, the more I'm looking at it, the more I think it's fake because I can't seem to see any um, Comte de Gasson clothing with a print on tag. Um, especially this feels all crappy and I think you just kind of threw it in. Anyway, I'll get around sort of 10 to 15 maybe for it at a pop-up, maybe online as well, but nothing too crazy. If that was legit, you're looking at sort of 35 to 40. Then we've got this, it is a, I'm gonna bone these out of the way just a little bit up there. We've got this very nice bell staff, um, what do you call it, gilet. Nothing too crazy, just a little bell staff logo just on the front there. There is some plucking, a little bit of damage, nothing that you can't fix too easy. Um, and it's a nice sort of herringbone trim all around it. A few little marks here and there, but nothing that will come out with a good wash. I checked comps. You're looking at sort of 30 to 35, maybe 40. And as it is, probably sort of 30, 35. I thought it was fake because the zip doesn't have any sort of branding. It doesn't look, you know, super high quality. Um, but turns out that is just how they make them. So I'm not complaining. This is part of a big, I think, 30 pound bundle. Um, forgot to say, all those football tops and the Mickey bits came to 23.70, really nice to the guy. He's on a frequent buyer. He was just like, I'll just take what you got left. So we're in debt to him at some point. Um, and then the next one up, we've got this Berg house, very similar to what I'm wearing. Um, this is a women's size 16. Um, so this will probably be sort of 20, 25 again, especially on all these old Berg house bits. They always go for good money these days. Old Polasek one. This one here is a really nice aquafoil in a nice sort of olive green color. Um, it's an AQ2. Where is it? Just there. So a little embroidered logo on the front there. These are really popular again with that whole sort of golf course style in at the moment. You're going to be looking at sort of 25, 30, 35 on this one here. Maybe pushing 40 because the color is a really nice one. Uh, size small, so a girl will probably wear that more. And then this last item is a Crossfell jacket. So Grimfell is a company that made a lot of high quality jackets in the past. I don't know if they're still going these days. This one probably looking at sort of 25, 30, just because of the styling, it's quite nice sort of park style. Nice little chest pocket up here as well. Um, so nothing too crazy, but a good eBay seller. Jeez, that was a voice break, wasn't it? Um, but basically that's the tag. Uh, it looks like that or that. Either or, they're worth picking up normally if they're cheap, under five pounds. And then this one, nothing too crazy. It's just the two all cardigan um, with what looks like curry down it, which is nice. Um, we'll whack it in the wash when we get home with a bit of vanish. Should scrub up nicely and you're looking at sort of 18 to 20 pound on that all day. Thanks for watching as always. I'm very sleep deprived. I'm gonna go home and have a nap, I think. If you guys could like and subscribe, I really appreciate it. And yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Peace.